ik ben Marit, ik vind het Engelser. Ja, dit mag ook het Nederlands. Uh, ik ben Marit en uh, ja, ik wil mijn haar weer een stuk korter en ik wil hier twee lijnen in en ik wil het weer grijs. Marit wants to have a grey color and she wants it a, yeah, a lot shorter than the especially the sides. And she wants a stronger line on the longer hair. And uh, yeah, that I'm going to make. <laughs> Will you turn for you and the rest of the world to show what your hair is now? And it's a grow out of the last uh, hairstyle we made. So now we leave the longer part a little bit longer and stronger. <laughs> Hello friends on YouTube. I'm gonna do Mara's hair. Let's first take away <laughs> the black bands. Okay, I'm gonna do a hair and start with uh, of course protection, like I always do. Make a new side cut with uh, a little tattoo art in it and I'll make a stronger line to the back. Asymmetrical, she has uh, also on this side a short part that stays because it makes this, the hair stronger. And she has a lot of yellow tones, so that's what we're going to take out and then give it an ultra nice grey color. Start by wetting the hair. I'm going to set out the line, and she wants the line to be stronger to the back, so I Try to get a stronger line over the center of the skull on the back. So now I take the line she already has, but now I'm going to work into a stronger line. Last time the line was laying here, so now I take it more down. And I get to be aware of the sides because there I have to connect. And then I come to this line. So I go about a centimeter under the ear, go out. This will be ultra short. So it's good. So it has grown a lot since the last time. Het gaat goed, hè? Ja. Ja, in het begin merk ik het niet zo zo, maar daarna dan merk ik toch echt dat ik weer flink moet kammen. Ik werd mm. laatst wakker en ik weet niet wat ik had gedaan, maar ik had waarschijnlijk ja, niet goed afgedroogd mijn haar zo bij zwemmen. Ja. En ik werd wakker met klitten. Dat is niet mm -hmm. normaal dat ik echt een kwartier bezig ben zo. geweest om het klitten uit te halen. Ja, dat is lang inderdaad. Ja. En toen dacht ik even, oh ja, het is weer lang. Ja, veel. Ja. Use my clipper as a comb again. Make a nice soft facial line. Now go to the back. And I work till the line I set out. So that will be the new asymmetrical line. Very strong moving down. The grey color is very much in there. You see the best film. Yeah, and I saw it there and thought, oh, it's so cool. Ja, dat is heel graag. Ja. Het is ook, ja, er zijn maar heel weinig die mooie grijs haar doen. Ja. En, en vroeger was het een taboe van, oh nee, je hebt grijs haar. En nu beginnen we, ik heb mijn leeftijd al van, ja, grijs haar, dat is wel ja, cool. Ja, zeker. Dat is ook best cool, ik vind het wel eens ja. mooi hoor.
Okay. Andere kleuren zijn dan ook zo mooi. Ja. Yeah. Ik zie dat de line is going straight down. Be aware of the fall of the hair, so you go in the opposite lines. And she has wonderful flowing lines because it flows nicely together in the center of her neckline. So her nape is wonderful strong. With my small clipper, I clean the contour line and give the neckline a nice shape. So I use a natural fall into the neckline. And now she wants to have three lines into the side. So that's what I'm going to do. Who will you have? Gewoon zo, rechte lijntjes? Of hoe had jij dat gedacht? Of mag ik ze in een lijntje zetten dat je denkt, nou dat is mooier als lijntje. Dat het mooier bij jou past. Nou, als het mooier bij mij past, dan is het even mooier. Oké, we are discussing the line I'm going to make. So I, I think I prefer, she wants three lines in it, but I prefer a natural line. So in the line of her natural fall so I make three soft lines but give it the shape she has I think that is better than straight lines Afterwards I shave them out, but now I don't because it will be irritated by the bleach. I don't want that. But I like the first of all. This is ready, the cut is ready. Don't need to, to have a lot of force because she's already blonde. Now I lay the hair on the line of cutting. I don't need it to be that short there, because I only want to get in this angle. So here I leave it a little bit longer and then travel over to my line of the clipper cut and lay the hair in that line and go straight down and leaving the front as long as possible. Takes your new hair on it. I make this curve especially for the fact that the hair don't need to be that long and when it lays back it's, it's, it folds nicer. So that's why I give it this curve. Now take the hair up with my fingers, part it in the same line of the cut, take about a half centimeter with it, you see the further I cut to the front, that's the less I take off. And give it also a graduation, so I bend it a little bit to the inner side. So it gets a new kind of shape and a better fall. And I lay this to the sides. I have a stronger line. Now you see the line on the back, and now I just have to connect the front on it. You see, it don't come off a lot. Just the end. And 
can do this layer by layer. Hold my fingers nice flat. Just take off the dry ends. Now I lay the hair from the front to the back again. Just gently lay it in a natural fall. Put it straight down. Control if the line is straight. And then I only need to do the short side on this side. So and then the cut is ready and can color it. Here you see the short part that is laying beneath it. it. Makes the fall of the hair a lot easier and stronger. Crack the line a little bit. Do this with my small clipper. Morgen a workshop to give. Nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Hermix. Hermix. Hermix is a couple of Yeah. And do a couple of So grappig. Give a nice shape to the part that laying beneath and behind the ear. So now I have a nice rounding and the hair that's laying over it adopts that rounding and lays down also in the natural fall so you get a much nicer fall to the hair. So now I can color the hair. Okay, put the protection on. What I made here is uh, a blue bleach with uh, Fario Blonde uh, on 6% base with a deep conditioner of silver. This is from Lacme. And only on 6% that's 20 volume so it don't irritate or hurt that much. You can put it all over because her hair is already in a light color but only has uh, yellow tones that I want to cap out. And afterwards it will be a grey. So I put all the bleach on and then I wait for 50 minutes at, at longest a half hour but I don't think it takes that much time. Because then she is already ready. Already ready. Hmm? Already ready. <laughs> already ready. Already ready. The nice thing about the conditioner is that you already know when you watch my videos, you don't smell anything, and there will be a new uh, bleach on the market that don't irritate at all. I already tested it will be from Lacme and it's made yeah, by someone who puts always conditioner into the bleach. I don't know who the guy is. You? Okay now I make the hair a bit free so it can take out all the colors and don't overheat it. Don't cover it up because she has already a light color so don't need the warmth of the plastic foil. Leave it on and con can easily control it and I wait till it's ultra light. And then I'll tell you afterwards which toner I used to get her in the grey colors. But this is with the bleach on. We'll be back. Okay we're back and uh, you see it. How wonderful light her color is already, and almost all the golden tones are out. Now I made her uh, from um, soup colors on 10%, is uh, 
3 presenters, 20, 10 volume, uh, 11, 8, and uh, a zero. Zero to bring in the even more gray tones. And this I use as a toner. It's ammonia free pipe in free. And bring it in an ultra light gray stone. Parts uh, of the color, and you put in uh, one part in a black, you get a gray. When you put in a blue black, you get a silver gray tone. I write it down. In the video. You can also apply this in the sink because it makes it much easier. But I don't have a sink here, so I have to do it with my brush. Mostly you leave this on for like 20 minutes and then it's ready. And it will certainly take out all the yellow tones that are even on the hair. I don't cover this up in a plastic foil, I'll just leave it this way because the skin already has a bleach uh, session going on and so. I don't want to irritate the skin at all, so I leave it open. And cold colors develop better in cold conditions, because the warmer it is, the warmer the colors will be. Now I lay the hair back, so I'm certain I have the color everywhere where I need it. And then in 20 minutes I rinse it out and show you the end result. Okay, we're back from coloring. You see the color is uh, gray. What I put now is uh, 10 feet of gold well. I love this product also to remain the colors at home. Strongest uh, the cool tones that are in it. Just applying it and then dry it. Stop blow drying in the underlines and building up. So far blow drying. Now take step two of the Lanza new line. This product I love. It smells wonderful, but it brings also a wonderful glow to the hair. And it's wonderful of condition, but now it even more and it becomes like steel. This product is wonderful for the hair because yeah, it's, 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 yeah. 
just <laughs> like a steel plate. Clean the neck hairs a bit. It's not much, but it looks better. They're not there. And this is Marit's new color and hairstyle. And here's the black band again. <laughs> <laughs> My love, will you turn for you and the rest of the world to show the end result? And how does it feel to be grey at your age? <laughs> and you have a fly. <laughs> Super fly. Bijzonder, hoe zou je wel grijs te zijn? Ik vind het special om dit jong en grey. Dank je voor modeling.